Okay, first step. Laptop webcams have really bad quality and desktop PCs don't have a webcam. This app, Camo, it lets you use your smartphone to act as a webcam. And since this app uses your phone's cameras, these are much higher in quality and resolution. Now this app will let you choose webcam of your choice, then you can set the resolution and even decide which lens you want to use, which is crazy. It also lets you apply effects like background blur and even the ability to zoom and track you. You can use it with apps like Zoom and Google Meet, and you can even use it to record videos directly onto your PC or your Mac and even to stream on streaming services. Now look at this, I can just tap here to increase my screen brightness, or I could just tap to toggle the flashlight, or double tap to take a screenshot, or just long press to open the camera. And not just these functions, there are more that you can configure. Get yourself action notch, and here you'll be able to set what happens when you tap the notch once, twice, or when you long press on it. And even what happens when you swipe left or right. And there's like a bunch of things you can choose to do depending on what you use the most and just set it up. Next, what do you guys think about these home screen setups? And they probably look nice because of this super chirpy doodle icon pack. So it's indeed the doodle icon pack which gives you access to over 4,000 custom icons and they look absolutely delicious. I love the colors, they have that candy type feel and because they have some depth, the 3D really stands out and you feel like touching them. Which is kind of the whole point of an icon to be touched. Anyway, so the icon pack comes with its own set of wallpapers that really suit the icon pack. And so you don't have to really go anywhere, you can just choose from one of these. The icon pack isn't free, but you can get it for free. All you've got to do is follow me on Instagram, DM me there asking me for promo codes to Doodle Icon Pack and I'll give them away to you. I've only got 30, so it's all first come first serve. Now what's the one thing you do on your phone every day that really impacts how long it's going to last? It's actually the battery and the charging and this next app helps you get that right. It tells you at exactly what speed your battery is charging, gives you a good idea about the health of your battery, and it even tells you the battery's temperature. And you know, this can really help you understand what situations or moments or places really heat up your battery and accordingly make adjustments to, you know, make that better. More importantly, you can set an alarm in the app to alert you when the battery dips below 20% or gets charged to 80%. Simply because keeping your battery levels between 20% and 80% is known to be the best way to increase your battery's overall health. And lastly is a game which isn't new, but I'm just surprised by how few people know about it. It's an insanely easy, addictive, but equally challenging game. It's all physics based and essentially you just have to get the block from one pillar to the other. It's like an Angry Bird game, but a lot more serious and with the need to be accurate. And it almost gets annoyingly tough because it all looks super easy to do, but quite challenging to be successful at it. But be careful because once you start playing this game, you won't be able to leave it too quickly. All right, that's it guys. Those were some apps that I thought you could benefit from except for the game, which isn't so new, but I think it's still a lot of fun. If you guys did enjoy watching the video, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit that bell notification icon and mark all really helps the channel grow. I'll see you guys in the next one.